And it's got some. Yep. I start to sail along these ocean waves. Nobody knows, nobody knows how to find us. It's turning out to be a perfect day. I just want to leave our normal lives behind us. Last he had us? I guess. So these are all tail on. I need the tails removed. Okay. Grab a container, the gray bolt. Look, watch. See, it's still got the. Yep. Oh, it's still got the whole skin on it, don't it? I'll be able to work with this. I need the skins off, though. Put all of them in here before you debate them. Before you do that. Pour them all in here. Oh, I see what Warm water cloth. Yep. So I'm working with medium heat. That is a rich one. That is. Now I see why people use that for cooking. I thought I heard the door. I'm checking that. Now you see how this is starting to curl around the trim bits? Yeah. It's because they're skimpy. Tell you like it really rich, like I do. Usually, I use a full eight ounces of butter. I'm not doing that this time because I found out the separation factor sucked. About two tablespoons. I would not be surprised if you decided to lick that paper. Like this? Because <laughs> you were there when I bought this, so you know how expensive it is. Yeah. This shit is not cheap. But, for the flavor, it's worth it. So what's going in there? This is going to be the Alfredo sauce. So I start with the butter. A lot of people don't realize just how much, how simple it is, but yet how much actually goes into making a good operator. Yeah. But to make it proper, I can't go over medium heat. Right. It's got to be cooked at the right temperature for the right amount of time. I'm actually losing a lot of time. Look at this. Butter is starting to brown. Are you using the entire container? Just about. Probably. I usually do. And I'm using a mortar and pestle for the video people. Uh, because of the music, I'm uh, editing out all the audio, so. Where is the actual adobo? Adobe. I'm not using that. 
one up, is that uh, the one up behind the bellows, but that's my mix of stuff, right? Yeah. It does start heating up before I go. I'm not touching it. Give it an occasional stir, though. You can see that's a lot of butter in there, right? There is a lot of butter, but there's also a lot of uh, cooking paint. They put a tie on it, it's actually seed. Are we using the entire bag for each? Yep. All three bags. But that's why I also have this, because at this point I can't use that. Because it's thicker. The whisk is more for liquidy stuff. Yep. Cut the other one open too. Pull the tie off though. Yeah, 
so I just barely don't have enough. And then don't use the last piece of bread. Or just eat it the way it is or put it for the squirrels. Alright? Yep. Put it in the bag for the squirrel. Squirrel? squirrel? You watching this? Mm -hmm. Fresh thing. Keeps it fresher for longer. Doesn't mold. Before it burns. Because that is perfect right there. Just for now. See why I'm using this? This is for new. Yeah. That hole in the middle of the spoon is one serving size. That is one thing I did learn. Yeah. But I'll make another box. We'll plug it. How cold is it? Pretty cool, but the bottom is warmer than the end. Actually. That, that, that. It, it's fine. Yeah. Didn't even go in it. Oh yeah, that's perfect. Yep. Slightly crusty, but still soft. You mind if I take a picture? Almost. Now that's a better quality uh, strainer than you had before. That it is. Fuck. I found the last time I did this, that, oh, because it was the second time I did it, that putting the shrimp in here, in the sauce itself, did something weird to the sauce. Anything seafood mm. that has sauce, you want to cook the seafood separate from the sauce. I know. There's your nut. See why? Just worth all the teasing. Yep.